what's up y'all what's up welcome 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 to my youtube channel <laughs> what's up y'all what's up welcome 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 to my youtube channel if you're here i mess with you i mess with you a long way i don't take any anything for granted at all meaning i know it's really hard to you know gather subscribers and gather viewers and gather likes and comments it's really hard to you know start that start a family all of that it's so hard so anybody that's already subscribed to my channel all of that i appreciate y'all so much i've been wanting to join the youtube family for so long and i just really been procrastinating with it and i feel like i'm meant for this like i really i want to be a youtuber so bad and i was just like this is something i can do this is something i can really do like so why not do it and i was just like I just could never find the time to do it. I just never really found time to do it. So now that, you know, you know, we're quarantined, this was the best time for me to just go ahead and start. And I know a lot of other people have been doing that too, which is just so smart. Like, it's just so smart. This is the best time to start your channel and, you know, <clears throat> start creating your family. And that's what I'm trying to do. So please, please, please like, comment, and subscribe. Please, 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 if you're feeling me, do that okay so what i wanted to start off with with my first video is a little q and a i'm a little mukbang mukbang however you say it i don't really know <laughs> but um that's what i want to start off with um so i figured that's the best way to you know get to know me just a little q and a and with my favorite <laughs> queen place ever american deli I have a 10 piece lemon pepper wet and crispy. <laughs> Y'all already know what's going on. So you know I'm finna mess it up. Oh my gosh, I'm missing my ketchup. <laughs> I'm missing my ketchup. Okay. So um I'm 100 real and I'm gonna be 100 percent real with y'all. That's what my channel is gonna be all about. Okay, so all these questions I got, I'm gonna answer them truthfully. I'm not gonna lie. So, just let y'all know, I'm a real person, okay? Let's go ahead and mess this up, but I'm gonna go ahead and answer some questions as well. Let's get to it. All right, where was your first job and did, and did you like it? Okay, so my first job was at Chuck E. Cheese. Yes, Chuck E. Cheese. And it's so crazy because I actually still have my name tag right here. For some reason, I don't know why I still have this. <sighs> I don't know why I still have this, but I stopped working there a long time ago, y'all. But I'm just a hoarder. I keep a lot of stuff for no reason, which is not good. But yeah, so that was my first job. Did I like it? Yeah, I did. While I was working there, I did like it. Um, but over time... It was just showing me that it just wasn't the job for me anymore. I really outgrew it, but it was a good first job. I started working there at 16, and um, I was a a party host. So I just, like, hosted parties and stuff. It was real cool. It definitely fit me. It fit me all day. I love being in charge of stuff and hosting all that and planning stuff. I just love doing stuff like that. So I love that job but at the time, but <laughs> definitely don't love it no more. Couldn't do it. <clears throat> Okay, next question. Are you a relationship type of girl or do you prefer to be single? Um, oh, that's easy. I'm trying to act like I got to think about that. Um, absolutely a relationship girl. Um, don't get me wrong. I love my alone time. I have no problem with being alone, but, um, baby, I'm a relationship type of girl. I'm a lovely dovey type of girl. It's nice to have somebody, but it's definitely nothing wrong. With, it's nothing wrong with being single, y'all. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. Okay. But I'm definitely more of a relationship type of girl. No doubt. Okay, let's see. 
are you satisfied with your business um I'm very proud <laughs> <laughs> but I'm super proud of the um the progress I've made with my business. I'm super proud. But am I satisfied? No, I'm not going to be satisfied until I get to where I want to be, which is at the top. I'm at the top right now, but I'm not at the top top. If you dig what I'm saying, okay? I'm super proud of my business though. Like I've came a long way. I'm proud of myself. I've came a long way since last summer. I started my business for for those that don't know. I started my business last summer called the K Collection. And it's a small online boutique. So y'all gotta go check me out. Y'all already know it's in my on um, description box. And it's in my intro. So Please go check me out, y'all. And females, y'all know y'all gonna love me. Y'all gonna love the cake collection. If y'all don't know about it now, y'all gonna know about it while y'all watch my channel. Because I have the best stuff. Okay, next question. Um, what's your personality like? Um, so, I'm goofy, I'm fun, I'm energetic, I'm a risk taker, I'm, de I'm definitely sensitive, <laughs> but I'm cool, I'm real cool, I'm laid back, but overall, well, I'm, yeah, I'm really all of that mainly all of that because i'm a hype person and stuff but i'm real chill at the same time um it's real hard like not to mess with me like not even on no cocky stuff like you know i'm real cool um i'm real cool to be around and you know Good friend, all that. So yeah. What makes you you? What makes me me? I think is my smile and my personality. Um, everybody says I smile a lot. But now everybody says I smile a lot and I do. I put pretty small, why not <laughs> flash it? But not for real. I'm just I'm I'm a happy soul. Like I don't have a reason to really be stained walking around with when people be asking me why you always smiling, like why not? Why not? Do you wanna look mad on? Like, I'm not one of those girls that just be, I'm like, that's cool, but it got that stank face. Like, no, that's not me. I'm cool, and I got the, the cute, the nice face to go with it, too. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Next question. What do you like in a guy? Um. Hmm. So, I definitely love a gentleman. Um, <laughs> I definitely love a gentleman. Um, someone that's funny, you know, goofy like me. You know. That's sentimental. That likes to actually, you know, likes to have like deep conversations and stuff. That likes to do stuff. That I like to want to do stuff. Mm, excuse me. I'm one of the type of girls that 
like to do stuff. I love to do stuff. I love to get out and try new things. So, we definitely got to want to do stuff like that. Spontaneous and stuff. But, yeah. Um, sweet, mean to other people for sure. Um, to other females, as you know, should I say, definitely need to be, you need to have that stiffness to other females, but just a sweetheart to me, like a sucker for me. Okay. <sighs> like I should, I should only, I should be the only one. <laughs> I should be the only one I see that side. That mushy side of you. If everybody else can see it, I don't want it. Okay. What do you mix with? I'm not mix with anything, guys. A lot of people don't be believing me, but I'm not mixing nothing. I'm just black. Yeah. Um my mama got good hair. Uh, my mama got good hair, so no, I would get it from her. And my mama always kept up with my hair when I was younger. What advice do you give someone starting their own business? Um. Mm, okay. So definitely stay consistent. I definitely can't say that enough. I can't say that enough. You gotta stay consistent, bro. That's the only way. Like, it's gonna be some days when you don't wanna work on your business. You're tired. You don't wanna feel like doing that. But truthfully, if you want your business to <laughs> prosper like you really want it to, you got to. You got to put in the work every single day. You got to want it. It's not If you're just doing this simply just so you can get some quick money, then this is not the job. This is not for you. Like, that's not for you. If you want to make some quick money, don't. <laughs> What's the point of starting a business? Because... Starting a business is all about investing. That's another thing. Be prepared to invest because that is how you're going to get the best outcome. Be prepared to invest. If you're not trying to invest for real, you think it's just going to come out the woodworks, and then, like I said, this is the wrong thing for you. Like, you got to want this. You got to have patience. Patience is a big thing, too, um, because you're not about to be... I mean, it's possible if anything can happen, but, you know, most people, you're not going to make a, you know, a million sales, you know, your first couple few weeks or, <clears throat> I don't know, just maybe your first couple weeks or so, you're not going to start off with making the, you know, a million sales. Like, it's going to take time to get to where you want to be, but, you know, eventually it will happen when you just stay consistent, but I definitely believe in, um... I definitely believe in manifestation. <sighs> Speak into existence. Whatever you want to happen, you it can happen, honey. As long as you got God first, you put in God first. As long as you praying every single day and you putting Him first, you good. Like it's just that simple, <laughs> for real. So I'm actually going to do a video on. Um, how to start your own business, some tips, um, you know. I know there's a lot of girls out there that really, really, really want to start their own business and stuff and don't really know where to start. And I would love to just help out with that process. Like, that's what, I, that's how, that's what my YouTube channel is about too, just helping others out. Like, I'm, that's, I'm all about women empowerment. Y'all gonna see that. Y'all gonna see that. Okay. What will your YouTube content be about? Okay, so, you know, I'm going to have some vlogs, y'all. Come on. I've been waiting to vlog for the longest. I do so much stuff. Clearly, I haven't lately because, you know, we've been all stuck in the house. But 
I'm always doing stuff like even just the little things I just want to vlog because I just have so much fun like everything I do even if it's just a little thing like I still be having fun so I was like so many like far events in the past that I could have vlogged in like my birthday my birthday is November right away <laughs> but I had a great birthday and I definitely should have vlogged it. But yeah, so I'm um, definitely gonna have heck of vlogs, hair reviews, some hauls, get ready with me's. Um, Y'all gonna see like cake collection stuff on here too. I'm showing off my product. That video is coming really soon. My new products I'm adding to my website. I'm doing like a whole little haul on that so y'all stay tuned to that it's gonna be real fun it's gonna be real fun um you know i'm gonna be doing having some pranks i'm definitely a prank girl i'm gonna be having a little bit of everything on here um girl talks q a some more q a's but like a different edition mm. y'all this bus Next question. What's your current relationship status? So, of course, I knew that I was going to get this question because everybody want to know my life. And you know what? It's okay. It's okay, y'all. I'm mean, going to tell y'all why it's okay. Because... This is why I made this channel. So y'all could, y'all could be, y'all could see the inside, the, in, the inside from Michaela. Y'all don't just have Instagram just to go off of, or my Twitter, or my Snapchat. Like this is my TV show. <laughs> this is my TV show, so it's okay. If you want to be nosy, baby, this is it. This is it. And honestly, I don't have a problem. Like, no wrong with that. I mean, unless it's on some weird stalker stuff, but. If you don't mean no harm, you really just be wanting to know what's up with people, then I don't see nothing wrong with that. Um, I'm like that about Jada, by the way. <laughs> Jada Wada, I love her so much. So I'm, I'm like that about her. I be wanting to know her life like crazy. I watch all her YouTube videos. I be on her Instagram 24-7. That's my boo. I love her. Anyway, so my relationship status is I am not in a relationship. But I... And talking to somebody so I mean call it what you want it's not a situation ship though <laughs> I don't condone situation ships um and just because you're not in a relationship with some with someone but you're talking to them that doesn't mean you're in a situation ship by the way <laughs> but yeah next question who's your favorite artist Jack we sing yeah yeah Jacquees. Jacquees is my husband. Jacquees is my husband. That's my baby. Uh -uh, that's my favorite artist, literally. I love him. <laughs> There's not really much to it. <laughs> I am in love with Jacquees. Period. Relationship advice. Um. So. I'm sorry. I'm one of those people that. Food makes me dance. <laughs> I ain't ate all day for real though. But. Okay so. Some relationship advice I have is consistency consistency is um it plays a big role in pretty much every part of your life <laughs> every part of your life like cons consistency is just big it's big and ex especially in a relationship like i can't even stress that enough especially in a relationship like 
if you're not consistent, then what is even the point of a relationship? Like, you have to keep up the same good behavior all the time. Like, you have to act a certain way with your significant other all the time. Like, you know, it's okay to have days and stuff, but definitely switch your stuff up and all that, it don't work. Um, I definitely feel like um, saying I love you and, you know, being affectionate with each other, um, a lot of the time I think that helps keep a relationship strong, especially when, especially if like, you know, you've been with somebody for a really long time, like years and years, like, you know, sometimes you sometimes every now and again you'll probably get tired of that person because like damn i've been with them for so long but at the same time like of course you still, you want to be with them and you're happy with them still but you know your relationship can kind of be like us uh, sometimes but it's like a little roller coaster there's nothing wrong with that but that's why being affectionate and being lovey-dovey with each other i feel like that that will help a lot just to keep a spark there like you know I feel like if y'all fall back from each other and just stop doing all that just because y'all been with each other for a minute or whatever the case may be, then I feel like that's when the relationship will stop going. We'll start going downhill for sure. Oh, yeah. And trust, like, ugh. trust and communication is a big thing, too. Definitely have that in your relationship. Y'all need trust. Without trust, there's nothing. Next question, are you in college? Yes. Oh, sorry guys, I'm a messy eater. <sighs> yes, I'm in college. Okay. So I'm gonna do a few more. Okay. Are you happy with your life? Yes, I am. Very much so. Um, stuff could always be better, but I don't, I try not to complain. I mean, <laughs> I try not to complain, but I'm very grateful for where I'm at. Would you ever be gay? No. No. <laughs> I'm good on that. Um, but I do love females though. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Or I love you from female. I love booty. I do, but not like that. <laughs> All right, y'all. That concludes the rest of my video. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I really, really hope y'all enjoyed my first little video. Y'all got to know me a little bit. I got to be fat, eat my wings. And I really enjoyed this. And I'm so excited to see what's going to happen in the future. Please, please, please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what y'all want to see next. I already got some content. Um in the books for y'all that I'm already thinking about doing but I just want to see tell me what y'all are interested in seeing I'm open to anything so thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see y'all next time see y'all later Bye.